Hello and welcome to Jams. Welcome back to Charles Xavier's Adventures in Kanto. Take that extended universe and that squirrel. So, um, the game seems to have spawned me in uh, exactly the same place it spawned me when I started the game. Which, yep, great, because it's right next to my house. However, I'm kind of annoyed because it means that the whole building the house thing with the chairs and the walls and the you know the walls that actually don't stop anything that kind of crap um, yeah apparently that just didn't work so that's mildly annoying so today we're gonna go have a look and see what we can find some more chews as per um, and yeah so I just see what's going on I'm told there is a kind of oh sod off the worst shot ever nailed it yes um, I'm told there is some oh <laughs> die goldfish there are other kind of biomey bits which I assume is what this snow is um, in fact I would say that's exactly what this snow is so that's I, I, yeah, as you can see, this is my first time exploring this map, so that was just perfectly timed. And it is, is that it getting dark, I wonder? Get bent, you bastard. Um, what is that? Eater of souls. Well, oh, that, that's not fun. Oh, rotten chunk. And there's more of them. Okay. I am out of here. <laughs> I am so out of here. Oh, you asshat, come back here. Um, where did my blowpipe go? I've got a feeling that that's going to be... That's going to be better at... Um... It's not, but at least I'm not wasting arrows. However, there is quite a few of these pricks, so... Um, okay, so that's not fun at all. Um, in fact, that is, that is distinctly the opposite of, of fun. God, I love this blowpipe, which is what she said. Um, yeah, so apparently you can't use this weird-ass boomerang thing underwater, which is frustrating. Um, so let's see what's over here. Yeah, I can place things on the background now. Sorry, I'm so used to purple ice block. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and assume that doesn't do a great deal. But there's another one of those soul eatery things. So, uh, just go away. That thing's really annoying. Come, just, no, yes! Fuck you! So, on one level, I kind of want to go down this hole and see what's there. On another level, it looks like the worst idea I've ever had. So, I'm not too sure. I wonder if there's a spawner of those things down there, or this is just happening because it's night time. I really should learn not to go out during the night time, shouldn't I? I mean, at least... Jesus.
That would have been an amazing shot if I'd have made that. <sighs> Fuck off. Okay, let's do this thing. Do I have any rope, I wonder? Because otherwise I'm going to look very silly trying to get out of here. Um, and the simple answer is I don't have much rope at all. Um, and there's more of these things. Holy Christ. Um, okay. Alright, this is, this is, okay, this, I'm officially declaring this a problem. What do you mean I can't dig through whatever that is? Well, oh, great. I think I'm in trouble here, guys. It's, uh, I'll sod it off. Right. Mm, could use the recall potion, mining potion, no, what the hell, ah, oh, just go away. Right, so all my gear's down there. Um including, you know, the nice boomerang, the nice sword, the nice, you know, everything. Um, I don't think I left anything in the chest that was actually any worth having, um, which is sort of just as well, really. Um, well, no, it isn't. Uh, sorry, I'm just talking complete crap. Um, once again, I don't know if um, being out here and then maybe dying or being out here and just taking too long means that all of my gear disappears so I'm kinda making a mad dash for it you know in between getting my ass handed to me by these fuckers I mean, my problem is that if I jump down that hole, I think all I'm going to do is just lose things like this star or the other crap that I've got. Um, you'd have thought the stars would be rare, but there seems to be quite a few of them. The, uh, the good news is these things don't seem to be able to follow me underwater, which is quite nice. Although, I could use, like, a mushroom or some other kind of health item before I die. And that's me dead. Great. Um, so, I sincerely hope that doesn't mean I lost all my, my items and things. Um, at least I've got another star. Yay. And now it's time for a death montage. Ah, oh, for the love of God. I need this to be daytime now. Holy heck, I was alive for half a second then. Okay, well at least all my stuff's still there and it's actually, you know, achievable to get to. Ah, so that's where all my stuff is then. Actually right at the bottom now. My god. To get down there and use a teleport potion very, very quickly.
Ah, at least there's torches down there now. <laughs> I love how I'm getting just a little bit closer each time. Okay, so I think what saved my life last time was the fact that I was in the water. So if I aim for that, that's me having got everything. Uh, recall potion. Nailed it! Get in the house. Wow. Um, okay, so... I think I'm going to end it there because I'm about to have some kind of stress heart attack.